we are here. This is what it looks like, you guys. It is gorgeous. Sophie. Sophie changed her shoes. She was wearing high heels. So, this is our table. It says, it says the name of our farm on here. There's literally three tables for our barn. That's how big our barn is. What? Yeah, put your heel up here. So I want to show them your dress. Isn't that cool? And it's like actual here. shapes. Here you go. So this is it. This is all of our fam. This is all of our barn family. We fill up a whole table. <laughs> There's Elizabeth back there. Say hi, Elizabeth. This is Sophie's purse. Goes with her outfit. <laughs> it's all pink. And if you think. This is a glue stick. It's not, it's chapstick. This is my huge meal. Oh, 300. There were so many good things there that I love. I, beets are my favorite. And then pulled pork. I mean, and then what this. he did, he even put like a I forgot to show you guys my dessert. An But I ate the pumpkin pie. Reserve champion for our hack division is Sophie. Oh, Woo! Wow, she got a bag. Good morning, guys. Welcome to today's video. She's very sassy. By the way, like that sass for me tagged her workout. Yeah. She's a baby, remember, so. Oh, of course, as soon as I come, she stops. We're all in our pajamas. We all have our hair a mess. We have the Sir Single, and we have all the stuff that we need for line driving. The only thing we don't have is the cart. Sophie just likes to do it like this because she's so just. Find the stuff. Oh, I'll find it for you. And it probably doesn't fit her. Yeah, it probably doesn't fit her. It's it fits Willow. Like Willow. Is it too big or too short? Too small? It's too big for... Like... This is good though. Anyways, we are all recuperating from all the food we ate last night and all the desserts. I ate half of my plate of food. If you guys saw my food, I was so starving by the time we went there that I... that I only ate half of what I picked. <laughs> wow! How is she gated? Sophie thinks she like. Gated. Sophie thinks she moves like she's gated. Okay, so one thing people keep saying is to always use words. You need to attach a word to all the things you want. I know, but that's why I have the flag to encourage it. But you need encourage to use your words, and also remember, she's just a baby. Walk on. And praise every single little thing that that she does right. Praise every single little thing. Pet her. I guess it's hard to pet her from where she is. And we have mud now. I love that we have this little area here, even though it's not like, even though it's not super big or anything. I like that she can come out here and. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> you are so cute. <laughs> come on. Anyway, welcome to today. I don't know what today is gonna entail. I think you should keep it too short, Sophie. She did what you wanted. I think we should just end it there. Cause she's getting frustrated and she's a baby. Did I mention yet she's a baby? She's almost two, so she still has a whole year. Do you wanna see the snakes? Then? Yeah, apparently there's snakes on this property. Mm -hmm. I'm not dressed today and I don't plan to get dressed today. See, I oh, it's warm in here. So we've all just been sitting on the couch doing nothing. Well, Gabby and I. <laughs> Sam's been out here doing work. The only one that cares, the honey's away. She's in the bed with me. Aw, you're such a good mama. Yes, you are. You're such a good mama. <laughs> Isn't she so funny? <laughs> She's got such crazy eyeballs. She's got such crazy eyeballs. I'm not the yeah, we got some mud out there now. I don't hear anything from the goats. What are they up to? They're eating in the field back there. Oh, they're in the field? 
How did the fat ones get through the fence? I always question that, and then I'm like, <laughs> they're like, oh, we're too fat. <laughs> yeah. How does this happen? When they want to go out to the field and... That's hard to stop. And they fit through the fence just fine, but when they have to come back in at night, suddenly they don't fit through the fence. Did you line drive Willow down the road? Actually, it probably came in the hay bale because it's flattened. It probably came in a, in the hay it bale. It was nowhere near the hay bale. Where did you find it? By the barn, like the goat barn. Well, it, it, so you think it's just a skin? It is. It shed its skin? They all want us. They're like, it's Sunday, do something with us. We're just having one day off as a break. Stormy boy, he's like, I want to go for a walk. So back at the back of our garage, at the back of our tack room, is this area that we have all of our storage because our house doesn't have storage. So it's in these boxes over here. Can you grab it out? No, you grab it out. Okay, we'll wait for me then. Without being dizzy. You feel like you're dizzy without being dizzy? Yeah. So if you on antibiotics. Yeah. So one thing we didn't show you guys is that last night, Dude. before we went to the party, here, let's close this. Is there any out there? So before we went to the party last night, we actually did put the baby chickens outside. We've been saying we're going to do it, but we wanted to wait. Oh, it's speckled. We wanted to wait until it was warm. Oh so they were in this. And now they ate all that food already. Yeah. And now they're in here. They have lots of room. I Look cleaned hard rock. I cleaned this thing completely off, so it was completely clean just oh, yesterday. Look at his crop. Look at his crop. You see that? Yeah. Oh, the black one. Yeah. Apparently, he is eating it all. You see that big pile of food on him? Look. I filled that up yesterday. Guys, look at my hard rock. Yeah, it's so cute. So, uh, what's I'm keeping you penguins? Let's, yeah, show the front of them. This is the one that we've always liked from the beginning that looks like a penguin. It's going to be a barred rock. Okay. So, barred rocks are those black and white oh, you're spotted so ones. They, they got fluffier since they Yeah, and it looks like a girl. Yeah, penguin's a girl. So, <laughs> look at Pablo. See? He always likes being a part of the attention. Pablo looks like a boy because. <laughs> See that, see that comb on the top of his head? Boys get their combs really fast, and the girls get their tails really fast. He's the only one that has that big of a comb, though. Yeah, so he's probably a rooster. Let's look and see. Let's count and see how many we think are boys and how many we think are girls. Feel that crap. Yeah. Whoa, that is all food. Do you guys see it? Don't eat anymore, dude. And they have a big, got, huge thing of fresh water in there. You've got enough to last you months. <laughs> You're anyway, they're loving it. They love their heater, which they want to sit. Oh, did you see that one fly from the heater to the... Look at this one. Look at how cute you are. Look. This one wants to peck you guys. This that one's lavender. too cute. This is lavender. So I like the red ones because we only had one red chicken and then the silky smothered it. So clearly she laid eggs before she died and now we have two. One looks like a boy. Look at those. They both look like boys. No, one's a girl. For sure? Yeah. The smaller one. That one. The one with the dot on. Good. Hopefully we get another girl. But anyway, these are them. And some people don't really like oh, black chickens, but our black chickens should lay dark, dark brown chocolate eggs. So. Oh, look at your girl. <laughs> it's pushed to the side. That's how much it has in it. Is that the same one? No. This is a different one. Yeah. Like, see that? Oh, this one's not as big. <laughs> So you don't touch my crop. <laughs> when my boys were little, I used to sing this song to them. And this reminds me of it. There were three on here perching. And I'm not going to sing it. I'm going to save you guys that. But it's, all of God's creatures have a place in the choir. Some sing low and some sing higher. Some sing out loud on a telephone wire. And some just clap their hands or paws or anything they have. Anyways... Those words have always like stuck with me through my whole entire life. Like my boys were little 35 years ago and I've always sang that song to all of my kids. 
mostly my boys though. But it means so much to me because there's so many different types of people in the world, like introverts and extroverts, and it takes both types of people to make the world go around. And everybody is so diverse and so different, just like all these little chickens. And everybody deserves to be who they are and have the personality they are and be respected and celebrated for who they are. And I'm so passionate about that. I'm like so passionate. And when we first started this channel, I used to talk about being yourself. And back then, I didn't even know fully what that meant. Like, it took me this whole time to really embrace and figure out it really it took me this whole entire time to Im really figure out how to embrace people being themselves and I love people and I love people who are themselves and no matter what they're going through I see to see beauty in diversity <laughs> still works <this> day. <laughs> not this one this one's a rebel Stop chasing chickens. <laughs> <laughs> she looks like a puppy. Don't you know that you're